Hi, I'm Christine Van Gein with the Canadian Taxpayers Federation. We're at Queen's Park today for the swearing-in of Ontario's new government with Premier Doug Ford. We're going to talk to a few people about what this new government can do to save their families money and what the government's new priorities should be. Well, I'm very happy what he's doing with the carbon tax, uh, uh, you know, declining it and doing away with that. That's a big start. And what about you? Oh, my whole easy answer to that is what he's doing. He's not going to spend. He's going to investigate, save, and in the investigation find better ways to do things. I think they should work towards eliminating the deficit because... Uh, the interest payments on the deficit right now are a billion dollars a month. There is no Ontario taxes for those who make 30000 or less. I think that's a good initiative on his part. The first thing I believe they should do is have a forensic audit of the books to find out exactly where the province stands. And if there has been hanky-panky, I think that it should be turned over to the OPP for prosecution. On a personal point of view, I'd like to see him get rid of uh, uh, time of day use on the electrical billing. Accountability is important for this government. So people will understand what's really going on because, they, you know, I'm the win government. They were doing all kinds of things and we didn't know exactly what was going on and wasting all our money. All I'm hoping for is that we are not going to end up with the carbon tax that is federal government pushing on everybody because, quite frankly, when we factored in the $707 uh, a year per household, it's quite unmanageable for a lower middle class group like me and my family kind of attribute ourselves to. We're looking for lower taxes, less regulation on business, and freeing up uh, the free market and individuals to do their thing.